What's poppin', what's poppin', what's poppin'? It's time to ghost them all. It's time to ghost the chicks that you going on dates with. It's time to ghost the chicks that you texting. It's time to ghost the chicks on Bumble. It's time to ghost the chicks on Hinge. It's time to ghost the chicks on TikTok. It's time to ghost all of them. It's time to ghost all of them. You know how they ghost you? You know how they stop texting you? You know how they say, oh, we going out Friday. Friday, yeah. What happened? What happened? Oh, I got to do this. I got to do that. It's time for you to ghost all of them. And you go see. Ghost them for three months. Stop texting back. Stop texting. Stop replying. Watch. Watch what happened. It's crazy, man. As men, we go through life chasing. And they told us that's how we supposed to do. That was our job to chase. But do you notice the dudes that do all the chasing? What happened to them? They get mistreated. All the dudes who chase get mistreated. And you sit back and you say, damn, this dude ain't doing nothing for her. This dude ain't, but she's still crazy about him. <laughs> That's, I'm telling you, man, you can't change him. That's what they like. But don't change yourself for them. If you a good guy, you be a good guy, but you be a good guy to yourself. Don't be out here chasing, man. I'm telling you. Every time you chase it, it's going to run away from you. She going to run away. And you might get her. But guess what she going to say? Hold on. My, uh, my my baby mom's, her, her uncle. Her uncle and aunt was telling me a story one day. And she was like, what did she say? Oh, she was telling me how they met. And she was like, she had a boyfriend before she met her husband now, you know, her uncle. She had a boyfriend, but then she said they broke up. And, you know, her uncle, he didn't want to leave her alone. He just always came with flowers. And she, you know what she said? She said, I never wanted to be with him, but he just kept coming. So here we are 25 years later. You don't want to live a life like that, man. You don't want to settle for a girl that you had to chase. Because it's not going in good. It's not going in good. Just like I told you in the last videos, if a girl not cooking breakfast for you, bro, I don't care if she's just your girlfriend. If a girl not going to get you food, if a girl not, she ain't the one for you. How many girls you talking to who not the one for you. How many girls you talking to who just giving you one word text messages? How many? So it's time to ghost all of them. You, you put the ball in your court now. You take over. It's time to ghost all of them. Forget that good morning text, forget that good night text. Man, forget that shit. <laughs> forget that. You pick up your ball, you go home. We ain't playing this game no more. We ain't playing this game no more. You get your ball, go home. They want you, they gotta come to you now. That's how you gotta think about yourself. You can't be out here fucking Chasing chicks. When we gonna go out? When we gonna? And we all been there before. Every morning, you high morning, high morning, thinking one day you gonna smash. You are not. But the dudes that smashing her, he ain't sending her nothing. Matter of fact, he he ignoring her. So instead of you turning to the bad boy to get her. Just ghost her and better your life. They gonna come back. Man, let me say something. 
because I've been on this internet thing since they came out when Facebook came out in like 06, then Twitter, you know, so like I've been on this internet thing to realize how women are. And you can't be mad at them. Like this is, this is who they are. So you just gotta accept it, but you don't have to play the game. But you see them online, acting gangster, acting like they pimps, talking crazy, acting like they tough, but in real life, they soft. They soft. But they gonna act hard just, you know, just to cover it up. But in real life, they buying dudes food. They paying for car parts. They, they getting their back blown out by a toxic nigga. <laughs> now, no dudes who say good morning. None of that. So the only way you can bring out the real side of them is to ghost them. And you got to mean it. It can't be a game. You got to mean it. Like, it got to be genuine. You got to be doing it because you're trying to better yourself. Because the man, as long as you chase these chicks, man, I'm telling you, you're going to stay stuck. You're going to stay stuck. You're going to keep getting ghosted. You're going to keep being frustrated. Because like I always say, even if you get the vagina, it's only so much you can get until you start wanting wanting a relationship. <laughs> that bullshit. So don't be out here chasing, man. Like, I'm telling you, ghost all of them. The ones you chasing, the ones in your phone, the ones on, like I say, Bumble, Facebook, Messenger, ghost all of them. They'll be back. They're not going nowhere. Matter of fact, they gonna want you more because they didn't got used to you telling them good morning. You're beautiful. They didn't got used to that. Ghost them. And I'm gonna say one more thing. It feels good when you got the rock. When you got the rock in your hand, when you got the ball, it feels way better when they come to you. Because when they come to you, they, they really mean it. Or they're using you, but you'll be able to, you know, you'll be able to figure that out. But stop playing the game. Stop watching stories. Stop liking their stories. Stop liking their pictures. Stop. And watch what happens. And you gonna see, damn, all they want is attention. They feed off attention. That's it. When they feeling bad, I'm gonna put you on game. A lot of y'all probably already know, but when they feeling bad, guess what they do? They go to their stories and they post, you know, they cleavage out or they post a, you know, an ass picture. But they post something so they can get a lot of likes on it. That's it. So he can so he can get some reassurance. So he so he can feel good about themselves. You gotta ghost. You gotta stop watching these stories. You gotta stop. I'm telling you. Because these days, dudes not even really. They not even having sex unless they paying for it. So put your own self through that fire. Say I don't even want sex no more. But they don't bring nothing to the table when you don't want sex. At all. I don't care if they went to college. I don't care if they got all this knowledge. When you don't want sex no more, when you look at them, you like, damn. That's, that's most of them. Now you do have your ones that, you know, bring more to life than that, but they rare. They rare. So y'all have a good day, man. Ghost all of them.